Hey everyone, 你好 Welcome to Smart Mandarin. I am Maggie Ma. This is what we believe the best way for learning Mandarin. Session one. Everyone can speak Mandarin. Let's think about some Chinese words came across English. I will give you six examples. Number one, Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu is Cantonese. In Mandarin, is Kung Fu. Kung Fu. It means martial art or effort. Kung Fu. Number two, a Chinese idea about how to arrange furniture. Feng Shui. Feng Shui. Feng means wind. Shui means water. Feng Shui, wind, water. Number three, a type of Kung Fu. And a very popular exercise in Mandarin is Tai Chi. Tai Chi. Tai means extreme. Chi means almost. Tai Chi is actually a very ancient Chinese philosophy concept. It means. Supreme ultimate. So the exercise and the kind of kung fu is Tai Chi Quan. Tai Chi Quan. We simplified as Tai Chi. Play Tai Chi. Number four. This symbol. Yin Yang. Yin Yang. Yin is the dark side, means shade or shadow. Yang is the bright side, means the sun. Yin Yang, but Yin Yang also has extended meaning, everything positive or negative. So Yin is negative, Yang is positive. Yin Yang. Number five, a Chinese national food made from soya beans. In Mandarin, tofu. Tofu. Do means pea peas bean beans. Do. So soya beans, we say. 大豆，大豆。Number six, another kind of Chinese food, fried noodles. 炒面，炒面。炒 means to fry or fried. 面 means noodles, pasta, flour. And face. So when we talk about doing business in China, people normally mention 面子面子面 is this word means face. 面子 Okay, from these six words, let's say how many already know. Number one, martial art, effort. Kung Fu. Kung Fu. Two, an idea about house arrangement. Feng Shui. Feng Shui. Wind. Feng. Water. 水 Number five, extreme, 太 Number six, 
almost. G. G. Seven. Shadow or shade. In. Eight. The sun. Yang. Yang. Nine. Bean curd. Tofu. Ten. Bees or peas. Do. Do. Eleven. To fry or fried. Chow. Chow. Twelve. Noodles, pasta, flour, and the face. Mian. Mian. Well done, you. Xie xie. Zai jian. Please leave a message or like us so we can make more. Thank you.